Hello, today we're going to show the ASTM D7078 rail shear fixture. So this fixture is used to test composites in shear. Uh, it's used to test more flimsy or thinner compo composites rather than hard, stiff samples. If you're going to test a type of sample specimen which is uh, more stiff, then I would suggest using ASTM D5379 and that's the IO Sepesco shear fixture. So um, back to the ASTM D7078 fixture. Uh, so you'll see there's six tightening pins here. They tighten some vice grips and that's where the sample goes right inside there. And then the whole fixture is pulled to shear the sample. So uh, along with the fixture we also sell the package with uh, some alignment pins here. So these will help align your sample. It's just a simple nylon attachment that goes onto the, uh, the top of the fixture here. So there's just a uh, quick Allen wrench screw with a washer. Just get that a little bit loose. And that just attaches onto the top here. just like that. So it just helps you get your uh, sample all aligned, but definitely not necessary, although most people do use it. We're not gonna use it today just because it slows things down a little bit and uh, we wanna keep this video moving. So uh, I have my sample here, again, more of a flimsy sample. Uh, we're gonna use this to test. Before you run this test, make sure to read through the uh, the full ASTM publication. That will tell you exactly the size of the sample you need and uh, a bunch of other good information like how fast to run the machine. But today we're just going to focus on the grips. So uh, once we have the sample in place, we'll go ahead and tighten some of the screws here. All right, and now on the other side. So a lot of people when they're doing this test, uh, not only will they get the values from the machine for both load and displacement, but uh, it's also common to place a, um, a sensor directly onto the sample, a little strain gauge. What that does is gives you more accurate displacement data uh, right at the shear face, which is where we're testing. So this sample is uh, pretty much all set. This would mount onto our machine using a clevis pin style adapter. So this is our uh, 1.25 inch diameter adapter with a uh, half inch locking pin. This is called a DM attachment by uh, some of the larger machine manufacturers and it goes into a DF coupling. So, uh, so all of our fixtures are the same, they're female. So just for show I'm going to mount this into the uh, bottom here and lock it with our locking pin. There we go. So then that would just hang on to the uh, bottom or top of your testing machine. All right, so we got our shear. Uh, so that's a quick demonstration on how the ASTM D7078 fixture works. If you have any questions, uh, be sure to contact us over at universalgripco.com. Thanks. Have a great day.